I can see by the sour, pinched expressions on all your faces that Richard has filled you in regarding the unfortunate circumstances that have forced me to relinquish my stake in your fair company. Ehrlich, uh, you should know that I have written a press release. Oh? I'm not gonna release it yet, but if I hear wind of these rumors spreading out of control, I'm gonna send it to every tech publication and blog on the face of the earth. Do you understand? Even Uprox? Yes, even them. Also, uh, this is a check for next month's use of the house as our office, but we'll be out by the end of the month. Richard, it doesn't have to be like this. From this point forward, you will have nothing to do with this company whatsoever. I'm replacing you on the board, and I'm giving your seat to Jared. So that's it then? Yes. So I guess we better get ready for that Vanity Fair event. What? Did you not listen to a word I just said? I heard thousands of words about rumors and the need to contain them. What do you think would happen if I didn't show up to this Vanity Fair event? I've already RSVP'd and given them a list of phony dietary restrictions just to cause a scene. I told them I was pesca pescatarian, which is one who eats solely fish who eat other fish. I think my absence would be noted. Arnick brings up a good point. It's true, let us not forget Minor Soggins Haversack. Yes, yes, Minor Soggins Haversack. We all remember his sack.